exactly did you do and how did your work resulted into yeah so i think you know start, starting from here what i started to do was to uh, and i had a really fantastic design team and we all kind of worked very closely together a small team but a very efficient hard working talented team you know and some of them are still really good friends of mine today as well. small as in what was the number of the team we were anything between uh, 7 and 11 like that you know and that's a good number so yeah. so one of the things that we started to do was to look at what kind of space branding did we want for the cafes you know so uh, i think earlier when i came in social media was still a young thing you know it was still fairly recent and there was a lot of pictures of people from that age group kind of having a good time things like that there was a lot more color also i think as a result of it being for a younger audience so there was a lot of red there was quite a lot of purple which was a brand color in those days what we started to do was to kind of change that and make it more subtle and make it more kind of put more meaning onto the walls in the sense that we used a lot of copy you know some of it was pun some of it was little local touches so for instance in i remember in in jogu it was a little far back now but there's a ccd in jogu like sort of on the main road and quite a prime location and everything and what we did was that we created a map of jogu and we made that you know in in 3d in out of mdf and then we kind of put that onto the wall and uh, we had this cup of coffee that kind of is pouring so the cup is sort of tilted like that and then the coffee is sort of pouring down the streets of jogu and that had a you know some amount of interaction so people would go and they would say oh this is where my house is or this is where i stay or so little things like that and then we did one in fatehpur sikri where it's you know sort of like this it was this mogal capital at the time of akbar and all of that so what we did was we said okay let's do this little visual play uh, we did these illustrations of um, mogal you know mogal looking characters but holding a ccd cup and a cappuccino and a frappuccino and things like that size of a wall so over the kinds of visitors to the taj and to the poor sikri would take that picture against it and you know send it to people things like that so we did a series of those we did one in jaipur one in jodhpur one in kerala and you know so that became sort of like a like a heritage piece that we did we also re looked at a lot of the packaging and with all the packaging i think we were very very we were very particular to to put in that level of detailing and storytelling so what if it is just a packet that's going to get thrown away when the chips are consumed or whatever you know so we we put a lot of love into everything that we did and one of the packaging things that i can just remember right now is that uh so we had to you know sort of do this work for nachos and they were supposed to be authentic mexican nachos and uh, of course just my luck that that i had some experience with mexico but you know i did a little bit of a deep dive with the team about what mexico means and what mexico is so can we move beyond a sombrero can we move beyond like a cactus and you know these like very sort of typical stereotypical things and instead we looked at um the day of the dead which is this beautiful festival in mexico where it kind of culminates in in them having these sugar skulls on the altar and some of them eat the sugar skulls and you know things like that after offering it whatever so the sugar skulls are a very very mexican thing that was one and so we did this illustration of the sugar skulls but with the big chip nachos and all that and then the other one that we did was mexican wrestling so mexican wrestling on las luchas is is big it's almost like what cricket is for us you know it's and they have these very specifically designed masks and things like that so we did one of the mexican mask and you know so so we would really try to put a lot of love and a lot of craft and a lot of storytelling into anything that we did i think yeah that's that's one thing i can say